Okay team, so I want a bandana effect at the back as I mentioned before so that it will relieve pressure on my head with the wig. So what we went ahead and did is cut out a really rough triangle shape so that it will come together better and Chris also soldered through a hole at the top so there's less chance of it splitting upwards. So yeah. G'day people, welcome back. <laughs> welcome to Sewing with Laura. Um, basically I totally forgot to vlog but uh, we went ahead and soldered some more holes well not we Chris because I'm scared of the glowing hot red thing soldered some more holes around the fabric patches and I'm going through with some leather twine and a needle and sewing it in and it's tricky but getting there totally worth it I had an accident and it won't focus and it hurts can you help me it's not that bad, but it hurts. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna get some alcohol for it. Basically, the ear is really, really hard to stitch because there's a lot of thicker urethane. So even though we've soldered the holes through as a guide, there's a ton of urethane in the bottom um, to pierce through and then trying to find the needle in the ear to pull through is very challenging. So that's the update and my thumb's short now. That's awesome. So Chris is suited up to see how his new shoulder armor and stuff goes, and it looks amazing. The dreads look really cool too. With a nice little uh, gift from you, thank you very much. You are welcome. I finally finished stitching up the cow. This is what it is looking like, and it looks awesome. I am most particularly proud about the ears. I'm slightly annoyed at myself for starting at the front and then going to the back because I found out all these different techniques like the crosses. I should have done that on the ears, but it is what it is and I've run out of time, so yeah, cool. We are going to eat passion fruit and then we are going to use this leftover pleather that Chris used for his cape and I'm going to make a bandana effect so that I can tie up the cowl at the back. So we've just loosely measured out some bandana. G'day. G'day. How are you going? Very proud. Oh, wow. I thought that was going to be a blooper, but it was praise. So are we just going to use Loctite? Uh, yeah, that's all you need. Um, then we'll leave it for about 10 minutes and then we'll just do a test to make sure you can bandana it and it feels fine. And then we turn. Done. Exciting. Your eyes look beautiful and blue. Thank you. You're it's welcome. Just a blur. Just a blur of beauty. <laughs> God, you're a good girl, but I know. I tried on the cowl the other day. I showed you guys in my previous video that it was pulling the cowl up. And this is the chunk of hair that was sitting on the top. So instead of cutting the whole thing and having the lace wig potentially fall out, I'm just going to cut the whole thing. Makes sense. Are you ready? I'm kind of nervous. Okay. It's done. Ah! No, 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 no! What? Don't you dare! <laughs> Look at that mullet! Wow. Look at oh that. God. Do you want this for your pirate Batman? I could like tie it around as like, you, you know. You could have scalped me at once. Yeah, point. I'm an obsessed fan. I sniff your hair. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> Um, but I think I might just go ahead and um, get rid of that, that even more. Yeah. Cool. Okay, team, welcome to Chris's bathroom. And I'm wearing my pajama shorts because I left my normal Catwoman pants and boots at home. But I thought I would chuck on what I've got at the moment. Here's the cowl and the wig and the shirt. The gloves are too hard to vlog in, so I'm not wearing those. Um, the harness and the sash. The sash is far too purple for my liking. I did not realize it was this bright when I was working on everything. But I'm going to try and dull it down, rip it up a bit. I've got a lot of trinkets at home that I don't have on at the moment. And yeah, it's gonna look cool. The bandana at the back works so well because it's relieved a lot of pressure off my head. And cutting the wig helped as well because I was getting so much tension up here. It was giving me headaches. So I guess the next step is putting on all the trinkets, um, doing some braiding. I'm not 100% happy with how it's going to look for Sunday. There's so much I wanted to improve on or 
do but I've run out of time and so this is just going to be version 1 and then I'll do a 2.0 where I'll also get like an awesome coat and, and a cutlass and things like that so this is just is what it is and yeah bye G'day It's me a biker Batman Biker Batman <laughs> You look so good That's the only update You look so sad Why are you grabbing your boobs? <laughs> <laughs> we Josh. We Josh. On your Josh. On your Josh. Love you. Love you, wife. <laughs> Spinach. Roll the melon. <laughs>